Welcome back to the Wait, channel. Can we start? I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. Oh, damn. Okay. What the f happened? What's up, sippers? Welcome back to the channel. If you are new here, make sure to hit that subscribe button to be notified of all our videos. I'm Sel B, I'm here with Tip and Stas, and today we have Apothic Dark. I'm pretty excited for this one, so let's just get into it. Cheers. Salud. Ooh, come mm -hmm. through, Red Blend. This seems Definitely. like something you would love. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. Definitely classic red. Although I do love the Apothic brand, like they have the Apothic Sparkling, Mm -hmm. which I love, but nobody sells it around here anymore, so I can never find it. This one is 13.5%, mm -hmm. so yeah. it's a little strong. It's not as dry as I think the other Apothic. There's a, a just a Apothic red. I think they first right. came out with that one. There's a white. There's a, a even a rosé, I think. Considering it's their dry version, I don't think it's that dry at all. And yeah, I like I, it. This is a winner for me. It's very romantic, too. Ooh. Ooh. The description says mm. there's a romance in darkness. It draws our curiosity and beckons a desire to taste the unknown. Hey, oh, hey, wow. now, listen. <laughs> Apothic Dark blends dark fruit flavors of blueberry and blackberry mm -hmm. with opulent notes of coffee and dark mm. chocolate for a rich yet silky smooth wine experience. Definitely, I got that dark chocolate. I love a good description, just saying. Yes. It's, it's giving you um some sensual vibes. It is. <laughs> it is. Very sensual. <laughs> Put the kids to bed before you open this one up. So like most reds, this is gonna pair with, of course, steak and your more stronger cheeses, a little funky ones. Yeah, the ones that you walk by in the grocery store, you be like, ooh. Yeah, those cheeses. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all know we are good for a game, so today I thought I'd ask you a couple questions, nothing too serious. First one, if you could live in any sitcom, which one would it be? And you have to sing the theme song. Just off the top of my head, because it seemed like it would have been a fun time. That '70s show. Mm. I think. Oh, yes. I think that would have been a fun time. And hanging out dun, 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 down the street, the same old thing. I don't really know the theme song though. I would love to sit down with Urkel. Mm. <laughs> if we want to go back. I would hang with, you know, Roger. They was always hating on Roger, but... Oh, yeah, sister, sister, yeah. sister, sister. Yeah. Sister, sister. Oh, I would have loved... Yep, that's yeah. a good one, too. He's a smart guy. Yeah. Do, 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 do. Yep, definitely mm -hmm. those two because it's always, you know, <laughs> some fun, but they had good family. If you had your own talk show, who would be your first three guests? Naturally, I would say Beyonce, but I know she ain't coming to my little show. <laughs> She um, is not. <laughs> just say, but I will have J.K. Hey, J.K. Hey, J.K. I still love you, Bill. Rowling, everybody. Yes, <laughs> the author of Harry Potter. Mm -hmm. I'd probably ask Jeff Bezos, mm. founder of Amazon. Yeah, just for a little tech finance type of feel. First three guests, I would do Barack Obama, only because you know he's been the head chief and you've mm -hmm. seen a lot of things heard a lot of things and you're very smart and you're cool so i'd like to talk to you i'd like to talk to will smith mm. because i bet yeah. he he's funny but he has a lot of wisdom at, at that I, oh jay-z so he said beyonce i'm gonna say jay-z mm. i was thinking jay-z but also <laughs> you know what lebron james lebron james has this show um on hbo called the shop mm. and Surprising and I'm surprised like surprisingly it's very like you know stimulating. They're not all talking about sports, they're talking about all kinds of facets of life. So I would like to talk to him and get different aspects and different things because he's been in the game for a long time. I mean it's bad that I picked all men, but that's just because I couldn't think of anything right now. <laughs> but those people I think are very influential and can lend more than just a surface value opinion. I would just bring these two. <laughs> 
Just but people want to hear I mean, from but me. But you do have your own talk show, Sip Station. That is true. <laughs> For the last question, if a movie was being made of your life and you could choose the actor or actress to play you, who would you choose and why? Issa. Issa could play me because I am the awkward black girl. She, uh, That's I just, a good one. I just resonate with her. She's she's very cool and stylish, but she also owns up to her uniqueness, and she's her. And I don't think I could be anybody else but me. I have my own little ways about myself, and I think she would do a good job. I would pick one. I just really don't know her name, but she is on Insecure too. I feel like she's oh the freaky. loud and crazy yes one? I feel like she's freaky but hilarious <laughs> Kelly ah oh, she's funny I like her <laughs> yeah she is a very important part of that show she is <laughs> yeah I look forward to, to every time I see her mm, I'm gonna gender bend a little bit and just say Ooh, yes Bad Bunny <laughs> I would love Bad Bunny Bad to Bunny. play me I don't know if it's cross dresses or just puts female clothes on or whatever and just kind of plays with that but i could see him in a, a wig he's like the male version so that's the i person, think so the person who's playing you no i, th- I think because he could act and he could sing that he could do whatever and plus i just really like him so i just wanted to say bad bunny <laughs> <laughs> that, that's really the only she reason why she just reasons. wanted to say him I mean, i'm not even mad at it so we could at him too right, right. <laughs> And that brings us to the end of this video. The details of this wine will be in the description box below. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And as always, we thank you for watching. Drink responsibly. We'll see you next week. Cheers. What's What's up, sippers? Welcome back to the channel. Wait, can we start? I'm sorry. (laughs) <laughs> okay. Oh, damn. Okay. What the f*** I thought we was about to bag it out. <laughs> oh, W-T. Out. Out. My bad. <laughs> Go ahead. I knew my <laughs> face didn't look. Oh, uh, like me and my... <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what's up with that. I'm going to work on that, though. <laughs> Are you? <laughs> yeah. Okay, mm-hmm. my bad. All right, go ahead.